Hey guys, here's a tutorial on how to change the UID of various Mifare Magic Cards using the PN532 reader on your phone. The Mifare Magic Cards we can work with include Mifare Classic in Generation 1A, Generation 2, Generation 3, and Generation 4, as well as Mifare DS Fire with 4 bytes and 7 bytes UID, and Mifare Ultralight Magic Tags. To start, power on the PN532 reader by flipping the switch. The Bluetooth LED will start blinking, indicating the device is on. Tap on the device search button, then select the PN532 BLE and tap on the connect button. Choose the UID changer function under tools. Let's begin with generation 1A. We have various options such as reading the UID from the original card, clearing the inputted UID, or generating a random UID. Let's tap on Execute, and the PN532 will work its magic to change the UID. Next, let's clear the UID and read from the card. The new UID will be displayed. Moving on to Generation 2, also known as CUID type. The first thing we need to do is choose the corresponding magic card type. Then we still can read the original ID from the card and generate a random UID to write with. After clearing the UID and reading again, we'll see that the UID has indeed changed. The same one-click process applies to changing the UID of Gen 3, Gen 4, DS Fire, and Ultralight cards. Even though the backdoor command code or writing pages of ultralight cards may vary, we've made it super easy to use. If you're unsure about the generation of your Mifare Classic card, you can use the terminal tool in mTools Lite. Wake up the PN532, scan the tag, and tap on the magic command button to check if it is Generation 1A, Generation 3, or Generation 4. We hope this tool will be very helpful to you when using the PN532 on your phone. Peace, and see you in the next video.